How is everyone doing? Have you ever wondered what happens to our athletes after they leave Frostburg? Well, senior defensive back Keith Smith may have played his last college game, but this is not the end of his football career. Can you tell us your name and what you do here at Frostburg State University? My name is Keith Smith. Um, I'm a senior here at Frostburg State. I play strong safety and free safety. Can you tell us where you're from and why you decided to come to Frostburg State? I'm from Annapolis, Maryland. I made my decision to come here from my recruiting visit. Um, I had sent my highlight tape to the defensive coordinator at the time, which was Bill Menard. And uh, I had got home from school one day. I still remember the phone call. He called me, told me uh, that he was interested and wanted me to come up, wanted me to apply. I applied. Literally, like the next week, I got accepted. I was excited. Coach told me to come up. I came, did the overnight. I liked it here. Told me about the defensive scheme, how it fit in. And I was sold at that point. Uh, right now, I'm presented with a couple opportunities to go and um, take my career uh, professionally uh, between European football leagues and arena football league teams being in contact with me. How did you get this opportunity? It came about uh, with me talking to my coach Anderson. I told him I was trying to take my career further than just college. I wasn't done playing football yet. And he told me to make the European players profile. I made it, um, I came up with this little resume that I, I typed up. Uh, he helped me do my highlight tape. And then once I got that done, I just started sending it out. I contacted over, well, I sent about around 300 plus emails to coaches. Wow, so hard work. Yeah, it was, it was like, it was a point where if I wanted, if I wanted, I had to sell myself. So I basically sold myself to these teams over in Europe and they're giving me responses back. Out of 300 and something emails, I done got about 20 responses back, some saying that they were interested, some saying they couldn't take players at the time, uh, some saying that they'll contact me. They were in negotiations with two other players. Like right now, I'm in a, um, it's me and one other guy for a team in Germany. So between us two, one of, them, one of us will be presented the opportunity to play. What did you learn at Frostburg that you would take with you to Europe? I learned, I learned definitely how to bounce back from adversity. Being here, we face a lot of adversity, seasons in, season out. Um, especially me coming here as a freshman. Um, within my first two weeks here, I lost a teammate. So that definitely set the toll like, to really value the game of football, value my teammates, value the opportunity that I have because his life was taken right on the practice field. So that affected me until this day. I still think about Derek Shaley. So. And then from there, us losing the coaching staff and having new coaching staff my senior year, more adversity I had to face, learning to just readjust, reevaluate myself and try to get the attention of the coaches and show them I was a leader. I would say this year be, was my favorite season playing ball in, as a whole. I mean, we went four and six, was our best, my best season since my freshman year when we went four and six as well. Um, but definitely me being a leader on the team, having an opportunity, have 100 plus players look up to me come game day and giving the game day speech, getting us fired up for homecoming was my favorite memory because it was right before the game, before we walked out. I just grabbed the attention of everybody and I just told them what was on my heart at the time. I don't know about you guys, but I think this is an amazing accomplishment for Keith. I'm so excited to see him represent Frostburg in such a positive way. Keep an eye out for your fellow Bobcat, Keith Smith. I'm Minuet Silver, back to you guys at the studio.